Well, good evening, everyone. A little bit after 9 o'clock. We've got some strong thunderstorms on both corners, northeast Alabama, northwest Alabama. Uh, one's really developing right along uh, Highway 72 and moving northeast. The other one is ahead of this disturbance. It's coming in from west Tennessee, and it's all ahead of a cold front. The front itself won't get here until about this time tomorrow night, and ahead of it, more chances for rain. But look at the temperatures out here just after 9 o'clock. Still very close to 80 degrees, and it feels like 85 or so with all that humidity. So we have one area storms leaving Jackson and DeKalb County, moving east-northeast, and we have uh, what's left of a line of thunderstorms that at one time was severe to our west. So you can actually see the lightning from Huntsville and surrounding areas that's off to the east northeast, but you can also now start looking to the northwest and see the prolific lightning from the thunderstorms moving towards Florence. Now this line of storms may not make it all the way across north Alabama and southern Tennessee due to the rainfall we had earlier. Atmosphere may be a little worked over, but this is going to be an extended storm track if this holds together. Moving through Florence and Muscle Shoals between uh, 925 and about 950 or so, and then Fayetteville in southern Tennessee around 1030, Huntsville 1054, Scottsboro 1141, and other towns in between. And you can get more information on another storm track I put on my Facebook page as well. Here's your seven-day forecast, and I really want to point out Wednesday and Thursday. Some very nice weather coming. Just now looking over some of the latest information coming in uh, here after my dinner break. And looking at Wednesday and Thursday, it's possible we're going to see slightly cooler temperatures than what I have on there. And I'm going to have more on that forecast and update on that coming up tonight at 10. And unfortunately, as we go into the weekend, we're going to see the humidity back and a few more showers and thunderstorms. And overall, just expecting general thunderstorms. So at times, could see a lot of lightning out there with some of these thunderstorms. Very heavy rain and some strong gusty winds. And I think the strongest wind we'll see tonight, if at all, is going to be about 40 miles an hour. I'll see you tonight at 10.